Hi, I'm Melody Schoenfeld with Flawless Fitness in Pasadena, California, and I'm here to talk about more lower abdominal exercises. Now, I've said this before, I'm going to tell you again, your abdominals, the ones that you can see, the rectus, right, it's one muscle, right? So you don't technically have a lower rectus and an upper rectus that you work separately, although there are things that you can do that you're going to feel more in the lower half. Now, if you're doing these exercises thinking you're going to lose fat in your lower abs as a result, you're not going to lose fat in your lower abs as a result, unfortunately. That comes from diet and that comes from building muscle across your body. But it's not a bad thing to do exercises for that. You do want to stabilize that part of your body. So I'm going to show you a really good stabilization exercise that's going to really work your lower abs. And a lot of people can't do this. You'll be amazed how hard this thing is. What you're going to do is you're going to take your feet and you're going to try to touch the ceiling with your feet. Now your legs need to be locked out, okay? So, not this, not this straight locked out legs look like you're walking on the ceiling. Oh, what a feeling when you're dancing on the ceiling. Now you're going to take one leg and you're going to drop it towards but not to the floor. Keeping that leg straight up towards the ceiling and locked out. So don't let that leg drop. You're keeping it up and locked out. You're going to bring that leg back and you're going to do the same thing on the other side. Right? So you're here and you're here. Just like that, okay? So, if all you can do is this part, if this part is really hard for you, just practice that for a while. Trust me, you'll get some burn. Um, and then you can work up from there. My name is Melody, and this has been some more lower abdominal exercises.